just a week after two former Uganda Broadcasting Corporation bosses were granted bail for their alleged role in the illegal sale of land belonging to the public broadcaster, the controversy over UBC land continues. And this time, it has dragged in the Minister of Information, Karoro Okurut. In 2009, Karoro Okurut and the then Kabarole woman MP, Margaret Muhanga, are reported to have acquired a 49-year lease of this two-acre piece of land in Kibira Road belonging to UBC. The two later transferred the ownership of the land to a Chinese investor under an agreement known as equitable interest, which has raised controversy. Equitable interest refers to a situation in which a person who has leased land is allowed to transfer its ownership to another person in case he or she has failed to develop it. Karoro Okurut says she complied with all the legal procedures and is awaiting investigations by authorities. Mid this year, July, the police summoned the directors in the company in which I am and I drove there and I gave them a statement on this matter, on what had gone on and they recorded it and therefore I will just wait for the report of the DPP. These are very competent uh, bodies and we shouldn't get worried. The truth will come out and the truth will set everybody free. NTV's attempts to get a word from police regarding the charges were futile as the spokesperson was said to be in a meeting. The two-acre piece of land in question is a mushy plot that would require huge sums of money for it to be reclaimed and developed. Land scandals involving big shots formerly at the UBC have in recent weeks dominated the media. And a group of outspoken MPs have vowed to unearth them and have the culprits brought to book. Chris Ochamringa, NTV.